the rate at which our bodies absorb vitamin B12 decreases with age. Vitamin B12 is necessary for the formation of both red blood cells and DNA. Because the human body is unable to produce vitamin B12 on its own, it is imperative that we obtain it through dietary supplements or foods that are derived from animals. Still, there are those who don't value this vitamin for what it is, and as a result, they develop a vitamin B12 deficiency. About 20% of North Americans over the age of 60 are vitamin B12 deficient. According to statistics, vitamin B12 deficiency is common among those who experience chronic fatigue syndrome and fibromyalgia. With that said, let's talk about the nine signs of vitamin B12 deficiency that most people often ignore. 1. Fatigue one of the first symptoms of a vitamin B12 deficiency is fatigue. If you routinely get at least eight hours of sleep, but you still feel exhausted, you could be suffering from a lack of vitamin B12. The vitamin is essential for the production of red blood cells, which deliver oxygen throughout the body. Even if you get plenty of sleep, you won't feel rested if your cells aren't getting enough oxygen. This is a sign of megaloblastic anemia, a form of the blood disorder. This form of anemia develops when the bone marrow generates red blood cells of abnormal size. This will leave you feeling very frail and helpless. One thing to keep in mind is that tiredness is just one of the symptoms, so you should not automatically assume that you are lacking vitamin B12. 2. Heart palpitations. A lack of vitamin B12 can cause abnormal heart rhythms, and other symptoms. When your heart beats too fast or too slow, you may experience the unpleasant sensation of palpitations. Your heart may start racing to the point of panic. Anemia can also cause chest pain and palpitations. Over time, this can cause damage to the heart muscle. An enlarged heart or even heart failure may be the end result. There are a number of treatments available for heart palpitations. In addition to taking in more B12, you should cut back on stimulants like drugs, nicotine, and caffeine. You should also make an effort to take in a sufficient amount of electrolytes, such as sodium, calcium, and potassium. Consult a medical professional immediately if your heart palpitations become unbearable. 3. Pale skin or jaundice Skin discoloration is one of the symptoms that can be used to diagnose a vitamin B12 deficiency. Your skin will appear yellow and very pale the majority of the time. This condition is referred to as something called jaundice. The number of red blood cells in your body will decrease if you haven't been getting enough vitamin B12. This aids in the development of jaundice. The condition can progress to anemia. As a result, the red blood cells are unable to supply the body's tissues with oxygen. This can cause a variety of symptoms, including pale skin, chest pains, and headaches. Because of this, your skin will not have its usual glow and vitality. B12-rich foods stimulate DNA synthesis, which aids in the body's ability to generate new blood cells. As a result, your skin will look normal again. 4. Extreme changes in mood. There may be a noticeable shift in your mood if you have not been getting enough vitamin B12. Unfortunately, research has also linked B12 deficiency to an increased risk of developing mental illness. Lack of B12 can wreak havoc on your mood, increasing your vulnerability to conditions like depression and anxiety. Lack of vitamin B12 may contribute to depression risk because it is needed for the production of feel-good neurotransmitters like serotonin and dopamine in the brain. How familiar are you with homocysteine? This is a reference to a type of amino acid in your blood that is very important. Damaged brain tissue and an inability to receive certain signals are consequences of high homocysteine levels and low vitamin B12 levels in the body. In 2000, researchers found that patients with this condition responded positively to B12 supplementation. Get as many of the right foods as you can to boost your vitamin consumption. 5. 
red smooth tongue, or glossitis. Have you been experiencing any strange sensations with your tongue as of late? If this is the case, it is highly recommended that you get your vitamin B12 levels checked regularly. This is one of the primary early warning signs that there is a deficiency. Glossitis is a medical term that describes inflammation of the tongue. When this occurs, you may notice that your tongue is beginning to enlarge and even changing color. In addition to this, you should be on the lookout for the development of lesions on your tongue. If you have glossitis, you might also find that the little red bumps on your tongue that hold your taste buds gradually disappear, leaving your tongue feeling very smooth. The papillae or bumps on the tongue, particularly the edges, may disappear in about half of people with a severe B12 deficiency. Patients often also experience pain and burning, most notably at the back of the tongue. If you lose a lot of papillae, even your favorite foods will taste bad because they contain taste buds. Because of glossitis, some women who are B12 deficient may find that they lose weight because food does not have the same appeal to them as it did before. Two female participants in a single study were subjected to close examination. The younger one was in her 50s and the older one was in her 70s. Researchers discovered that the patient's lack of vitamin B12 was the root cause of their glossitis, despite the fact that they displayed no other symptoms. Therefore, even though you might initially believe that your swollen tongue is the result of an allergic reaction, you might actually just need to increase the amount of B12-rich foods that you eat. 6. Difficulty breathing If your body isn't making enough red blood cells, oxygen will be unable to be transported effectively. Your breathing will be restricted as a direct result. This typically occurs when you are deeply involved in some sort of physical activity. Let's say you're walking a bit too fast, and before you know it, you're struggling to get your breath back. Many things can cause shortness of breath, but low vitamin B12 levels have been linked to the problem more than once. In 2010, researchers focused on a man in his early 40s who had been showing signs of anemia. This included a lack of B12 in the body. Following a thorough investigation, the researchers came to the conclusion that taking the appropriate supplements can alleviate these symptoms. 7. Vision Problems Are your eyes giving you trouble recently? Do you, in other words, find it difficult to see? Vision problems are another frightening symptom of B12 deficiency. The benefits of vitamin B12 extend beyond the blood to the nerve cells as well. A lack of nutrition for the nervous system can affect the optic nerve of the eye. To put it simply, the optic nerve connects the retina to the brain. When the brain receives visual information from the eye, it does so via the optic nerve. A lack of vitamin B12 blocks this route, preventing the brain from receiving vital visual information from the eye. As a result, visual impairment sets in. If this describes your situation and you want to feel better, doctors advise taking B12 supplements. 8. Feeling dizzy and wobbly. Dizziness, like difficulty breathing, can have various causes. Heart disease and hearing loss are just two examples. However, extreme dizziness is also a symptom of a lack of vitamin B12. Imagine for a moment that you are going about your daily chores around the house when all of a sudden you start to feel a little off balance. This is your blood cells way of telling you that you need more of them because you're dangerously low on them. Your mental equilibrium is threatened because your brain isn't getting enough oxygen. One study conducted in Turkey looked at the vitamin B12 levels of patients who went to the emergency room for treatment of dizziness and compared them to those of 100 healthy volunteers. The conclusion reached was that those patients who complained of dizziness had 40% lower levels of B12 than the volunteers. In addition to dizziness, confusion may also occur if this deficiency is present. The elderly are disproportionately affected, like anemia. This is a symptom of vitamin B12 deficiency, which leads to neuropathy. 
Many elderly people's neurological problems go untreated because of how easy it is to forget about B12 intake. Their vertigo is typically attributed to simple old age. In another case, study from 2010, researchers looked at an elderly patient with severe dizziness who had otherwise normal brain activity based on CD scans. Experts examined him and came to the conclusion that he was lacking in vitamin B12 and exhibiting symptoms of neuropathy. 9. Nerve Injury Lack of vitamin B12 can cause a variety of unpleasant symptoms, including a tingling or prickling sensation all over the body. If your nerves have not been getting enough myelin, you will experience paresthesia. Myelin is a fatty, insulating sheath that surrounds and cushions your nerves. Vitamin B12 aids it in a direct fashion. If you're lacking in something, your body won't be able to make enough myelin, leaving your nerves exposed and less likely to work as they should. It would be premature to blame a lack of B12 for paresthesia, as there are many other factors that can contribute to the condition. Sometimes it's not even considered that this kind of shortcoming could exist However, research has connected the lack to the neurological disorder. Get plenty of vitamin B12 and do yourself a favor. What leads to a lack of vitamin B12? Adults require approximately 2.4 micrograms of vitamin B12 on a daily basis, while women who are pregnant or breastfeeding require more. Infants and young children have age-specific vitamin B12 requirements, so Deficiency symptoms may arise if you aren't taking the correct amount every day. Our bodies contain beneficial bacteria that assist in digestion and the absorption of nutrients. However, a misbalance of gut bacteria can throw off this absorption process. Vitamin B12 is an example of this. Chemotherapy is another possible reason. Chemotherapy drugs have been linked to gastrointestinal distress and inflammation. Vitamin B12 deficiency is often misdiagnosed or not diagnosed at all because its symptoms are so general. It is recommended that you consult a medical professional if you are experiencing any of the symptoms described in this video. Those who are vegan or vegetarian, over the age of 60, pregnant, or nursing, or who have a medical condition that can deplete B12 levels are at greater risk for this deficiency. What to do if you're low on vitamin B12? Vitamin B12 deficiency is rare because most people get enough of it from the food and beverages they consume. Vitamin B12 can be found in a variety of foods, including red meat, fish, poultry, eggs, milk, and other dairy products. Alternatively, you can eat foods that have been fortified with vitamin B12. Fortified foods are those that have had nutrients and vitamins added to them that they normally wouldn't contain. A few examples of fortified foods are breakfast cereals, nutritional yeast, plant milk, and some types of bread. Always double-check the Nutrition Facts panel to ensure that the food you're eating has been fortified with vitamin B12. Vitamin B12 supplements are another option. Vitamin B12 is commonly found in multivitamins. Consult your doctor or pharmacist for advice on selecting the right supplement. A diet low in inflammatory foods is essential for maintaining a healthy digestive tract. Fast food, packaged foods, fried foods, low-quality meats, and food additives are all examples of foods you should try your best to avoid. You shouldn't have a problem with vitamin B12 deficiency if you stick to a healthy diet and take your B12 supplements as directed. Now that you are aware of the most prominent symptoms of vitamin B12 deficiency, you can speak with your doctor with confidence if you have any concerns when to see the doctor. Consult your doctor about getting tested for vitamin B12 deficiency if you've been experiencing any of the symptoms listed in this video or if you're at risk for developing a deficiency. Make an appointment with your doctor if you have a history of vitamin B12 deficiency but are experiencing any new or concerning symptoms 